The actor who plays Oleg the Cook is a skilled impressionist with an arsenal of over 100 celebrity voices to choose from. And he's going to give us a sample of some of his spot-on imitations. It's Jonathan Kite. Welcome back. Thank you. So I didn't realize, I assumed mm -hmm. that you were one of those people who started doing impressions as a kid. No. It happened like very a, late in life. As a survival mechanism, but it wasn't until later that you realized, and, and what is the necessary component every impressionist must have? Is it an ear? It's an ear. It's why you hear singers can do a lot, um, and part of it is you have to kind of hook in to what you figure out. Like, I have a thing where I have to listen to multiple clips of somebody, okay. and then I'll cue in. So you, you kind of have to develop your own way to learn them. Oh, interesting. Yeah. So I know some people that can just, like, hear you once and do them, or somebody that it takes them a year. And for me, I had to learn how to learn them for myself. Who's your favorite other celebrity impressionist? Um, who does impressions, you mm -hmm. mean? Probably Kevin Spacey. Really? Yeah, because I, he gets their essence down so well. He does a lot of them, and he does, and he's, like, he does Pacino, and he does Walk-In, and he's worked with both of them, wow. and they, he, he, like, knows something we don't yeah, know he's about got them. Some subtle like, his Walk-In, is there something like, oh, that's yep. a personal story you're pulling that from or something? Well, let me give you some, uh, some scenarios. Okay. Uh, Donald Trump getting dragged off a plane. Okay, listen, listen, first, believe me, believe me, if you drag me off this plane, you're not going to get a single bite of this amazing chocolate cake. It's fantastic. Can I ask you, are you throwing me off this plane? Okay. How about uh, former President Barack Obama doing his taxes? Uh, hey, uh, Michelle, uh, how many of these uh, jet ski tours can we write off? <laughs> okay, um, Tom Hanks emceeing an Easter egg hunt. Well, welcome to Jesus 2.0 day. <laughs> now, first of all, if my movies have taught us anything, <laughs> oh, it's that I know about chocolate. <laughs> Life is like a box of it. <laughs> Again, I'm a Christian Bale auditioning to play Dick Cheney in a movie. Um, all right, all right, listen, guys, I got the sides. I like them a lot. Let me just say, let me ask you something, all right? All right, first of all, I think I got this whole character down, but I don't really have, like, the puppeteering skill done yet. And also, I've I'm, I'm got a question. What, 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 what Dick Cheney, which one am I going to play? Am I going to play him in life, or am I going to play him in the office? Uh, I just need to know if I need to wear the Darth Vader mask. <laughs> oh, Dick Cheney. So, uh, what about Christian Bale uh, with his American accent? He, um, which, where, where would it be for, like, Alfred... He has a very sort of, he like, choose the words. <laughs> Alfred, listen, I can't let Rachel die. I can't, I can only save Harvey. And then if he's, like, the suit's too tight as Batman. All right, listen. I have to have him in his air. I'm like, get him a medium. This is small. Just get him. He's like, listen. All right, that's a lot better. I a lot of tightness on it, right? Yeah, they, they measured him for the bat suit when he was in The Machinist. Yeah, exactly. And then he blew up, and then they go, all right, I'm just going to get inside. And, uh. <laughs> Sounds like one of those smokers who's yeah, telling exactly. these guys the danger. Yeah, they have to, the bat suit is so tight, they have to give him a tracheotomy. And he still smokes. Does he still smoke? No, but you know those commercials. Oh, I like, know. But then they're always dead. <laughs> they're like, Why didn't you show me this commercial before? Like, it just cuts the end of Batman, and Christian Bale died from suffocating in the suit. It's very sad. Jonathan Kite, everyone should uh, watch the season six finale. Yes, I'm alive. Se season seven. Kennedy, you're alive. Thank you. I feel more alive than ever, having been so close to your life force that it has changed me for the better.